Welcome to Toast. Thoughts of a Stoner to Look, Designer just did an interview with The Breakfast Club this morning, or yesterday morning, just got released this morning. And I mean, listen, Designer immediately got shut down by, by Charlemagne uh, when he was speaking to these motherfucking talking like the nigger from the wild thornberries with the crazy hair he was like listen bro you gotta shut the fuck up with that shit you gotta calm down you gotta slow down bro we don't understand you and you're speaking to the world when you're talking on this shit right so designer kind of calmed down a little bit but you know he was still speaking on some wild shit but listen that interview was pretty cringeworthy i ain't gonna lie man but he got um on a couple of topics where he basically spoke about why he said fuck new york radio and how he feels like he he's not getting pushed the way he feels he deserves to get pushed he, he feels like he has more quality music and um and they're not pushing it now ye ye envy and charlemagne was i mean bro they were pretty much calling him a one-hit wonder without calling him a one-hit wonder bro like they was like kind of chomping the nigga off to him in his face man like they were like calling him a one-hit wonder without calling him a one-hit wonder bro like you gotta watch the interview to see what i'm talking about i obviously can't play it here but y'all can go check it out all right i'm sure you know how to find that shit now he also spoke on uh when he got arrested last year now he said that um he 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 bucked on some crazy motherfucker for driving crazy he called the cops on designer and his friends they got their car searched all right they were looking for um a gun didn't find a gun so but they found pills they found prescription pills they all got locked up right now he said they were locked up for a couple of days and he said that the police were uh in the back taking pictures and they were like yeah look at the panda in the cage you know what i'm saying some pretty fucked up shit and charlemagne this is how i know charlemagne's a house nigga Charlemagne thought that that shit was just hilarious, bro. That shit's not funny, bro. That shit ain't funny. You the motherfucker that wrote a book called Black Privilege, bro. You, uh, uh, man, listen. Y'all can go cake for that book if you want to. The book itself is probably good, maybe. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm, I'm sure he's saying some good shit in it, but the title is on some coon shit. All right, I don't give a fuck what you think. Now, designer... I mean, man, listen, bro. They really don't got no love for designer, okay? And you can tell that DJ MV is still mad about the, the uh, fuck New York radio line. I mean, he was just, he just seemed kind of serious tone with designer for most of the interview, all right? And then uh, designer, he said he had a show tonight at the PlayStation Theater or whatever. I don't know what the fuck that is, but he said he had a show, okay? And he asked, he asked the Breakfast Club if they was going to come out and support this nigga Charlemagne said, hell no, I got a wife, nigga. I ain't going to no designer show. You 20. Angela Yee said, uh, I'ma go if so-and-so goes. He was talking about another girl. She said she'll go if like someone else go. I'm just like, damn. This nigga Envy just put his head down. So listen, man. The interview was just kind of weird. I ain't gonna lie, man. It was eh. It damn sure wasn't the Breakfast Club's best interview. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this, man. If you ain't seen the interview, go check it out. There's actually a point in the interview where designer slows down all the way and starts talking like this. For real. But y'all let me know what y'all think about this, man. I'm about to get up out of here. I'm gone.